What's it like to be able to live forever? <laughs> oh, my back hurts. <laughs> I don't really know. I hold a lot of regret. People come in and out of my life. And they live and then they die. I've tried myself to die. It hasn't really worked. You know, people, they uh, tell me that it's my purpose in life that I should give them advice and I don't know, they think I'm some kind of god. I'm no god. I'm terribly weak. And I spend my days traveling through my memories. I met her over a hundred years ago. She used to stare at me. She judged me. To the world, I was just a prophet, but to her, I was more like this equation that nobody could figure out. She knew the circumstances. She knew that it was forever for me and a countdown for her. But she still did what nobody else would fully allow me to do. She let me love her. I once heard a quote from a soldier of the Dark War. It's not about who you are, it's about how you'll die. <laughs> if you were to ask me who I was, I'd think of the time I spent with her. And that's why I constantly replay those memories over and over again. Something happened then. Something that'll give me an answer to the equation. Let me know how to die. So, how would you like to die? I'd like to be in a spaceship made entirely out of glass and diamonds. Be hurled to the sun at an impossible speed. And just as I'm about to make contact, I experience all the possible, conceivable, imaginable colors. 